Well, the play is loosely based on the first nine and a half chapters of the book of Genesis, uh, but it's really a story about the relationships between parents and children. Yeah. But we can have real children if we want to. Real children? Just like us. That's right, isn't it, Father? Adam starts out and he's very much like a child. Both Adam and Eve are very much like a child. So throughout, throughout the first act, it's really going through the stages of growing up. You're very happy, childlike in the beginning, but also you get scorned by God, and God casts you aside, and it's very, very emotional. And, and the woman did eat, and her eyes were open. That her teeth the music is a way to express something that can't, it, it's so much more yeah. than just saying it. Like it's like um, creation and, and the magic in you and the yearning in you, you can't just say it, you, you have to sing it, and it has to come out in a song. You have eaten the fruit. Yes, Father, but it's all right. It didn't hurt me after all. And now, oh, Father, my head is so full of impossible dreams. <laughs> and it's a story about uh, our ability to make new choices and ha start again or have second chances. Kind of cool to, to be able to go through growing up on stage and, and all of the, the emotions and changes that a person goes through as, as they're developing. And, Father, that's not true! Adam, I'll make a new life for you. A better life. Things will be as they were. But I don't want another wife. I want Eve. No, Adam. Eve is leaving here. Well then, what if I went with her? It's very entertaining, um, but it's all, and, it, and it has such a positive message. This show has such a positive message. And I would become prepared f feeling to be able to cry and like just feeling a lot. It takes you through a lot of up and downs, emotional up and downs. Heat and hunger, when I was younger, I see it now.